friends, Running Kimono here. We have a bit of Walgreens midweek shopping, Rite Aid cheapies, and then 10 cents for two Mr. Clean multi-surface cleaners over at Family Dollar. What? That is unheard of. Get your coat on and start the car. So I didn't get to test this one out. Um, this is day 7,000 of snowstorm. So the snow is really bad up here, so I am just safely at home. But I did see a good friend, Brody Saves, talk about this on her Instagram where she showed receipts. It is working and it is still working this morning. If you want to go out and take a leap of faith on this one, I would if you have a family dollar close to you. Okay, so we're at Family Dollar. I know it's a store that we don't cover a lot. You're going to be looking for one of these $4 or $4.10 Mr. Clean multi-surface cleaner, either pet or the lemon scent. Those two, and those are the two that she tested. You got to do this in store if you wanted to do it as a curbside. That's not the deal. You have to do it in store. Load this digital coupon, which is a four off a of two. So you would just hit that bottom button where it says clip coupon, and then it'll be on your family dollar account. So at the register, these um, cleaners are ringing up for 205 so for two of them, either the pet scent or the lemon scent, please pay attention, guys. It's 410. Subtracting that digital coupon, you're paying 10 cents plus the tax for two big bottles of multi-surface cleaner. Definitely run out to the store. This can change or get canceled at any time. Run, run, run. And in the comments down below, if you're having trouble at your store or what have you, please share it with us. She's up in Texas, so um, I'm pretty sure it's it's throughout the U.S. because a lot of people were saying they were having success with it. But I would go do this right away. And again, special thank you to Brody Saves over on Instagram. This is a really good deal, like five cents for one of those cleaners. If the snow clears up, I'm going to try and get out there myself. So now we're back at Walgreens, everybody's favorite. And here's something interesting. If you go to the Walgreens website or try to do a curbside pickup, these 12 counts of the pastries or the Pop-Tarts um, are part of the buy one, get one free. So they have an eight count box or a 12 count box. This is where you would get your most bang for your buck. Yes, you can get a price modification for up to one item at your Walgreens. So if they'll do that in store, I would definitely ask if this is not part of it in store. But if you look at um, online, $4.29 on a buy one, get one free, and that's the same price for the eight counts. Favorite app I bought it has a dollar back when you buy two. So that drops it down to like $3.29 for two for 24 Pop-Tarts. So again, for those of you that like to look at the math, uh, two boxes of the pop tarts, uh, it's $4.29. Get your receipt, photograph it to Ibotta. So it makes it $3.29 for the two or $1.64 per box. It is okay to use Walgreens cash if you're doing this deal. If you're going to do it as a curbside, uh, what I would recommend is to use the code FRIENDS20 for extra savings. But then you're going to have to get that receipt in store. So you'll have to tell the cashier to run it through a regular register, not a zebra. So you get a printed receipt. If not, you're not going to get a receipt and you need it for Ibotta. So boom, there it is. Okay, so for this deal, you might have to do it quickly, but um, I did this as a curbside pickup earlier in the week. There were two clearance raw sugar body washes, and these are 25 ounces, so they're massive bottles. And then there's the kids one that's working with this promotion of buy three, get $5 back in Walgreens cash. So I don't mind that. So for this promotion, I grabbed... Um, Two clearance and then one kid's uh, raw sugar shampoo, body wash, whatever, for thirteen seventeen. I used the code FRIENDS20 for $2.64 off. So the total is $11.16. I used 10 bucks in Walgreens cash. And then I got back five for buying three. And then I got back $5 from Ibotta. There's a rebate that when you buy two of these body washes, you get $5 back. So it makes it $0.38. Cents per raw sugar product, which is really cheap. And it is okay to use Walgreens cash to pay. Now, when the re the rebate reset for me on Ibotta, I took that kid's shampoo, which is like $5 and some change. And I just scanned that barcode into the app. And guess what? That's attaching. So if you wanted to get like, you know, $13 of um, raw sugar kids, that's another way to do it. Make sure that rebate isn't going to disappear for you because um, I think it was like on 24 hours this morning, but what a deal.
next deal is in the dollar spot and I did these in store uh, these Kleenex three packs it's like a travel size to go that you put in your purse or whatever they are $1.25. We have a dollar digital coupon. So you guessed it. After that coupon, it's 25 cents. I did this, I believe, on Tuesday or Wednesday, and it's still working. So, I mean, definitely scan in the Walgreens app. Is it attaching? 25 cents is a very good stock up price. Now, I know that this coupon is also doing this weird glitch thing over at Dollar General. However, I cannot find them at my local Dollar General. So they either put those packages under lock and key just not out on the floor i checked the front of the store near the cash registers that whole key fob area you know with all the different stuff and then the dollar spot i can't find it at any dollar general so i'm happy to get two over at walgreens so the next door that we're going to go to guys is rite aid and uh not much going on there but i did one quick deal and it is with these clearance pantene Hydra Glow shampoo and they are the sulfate free one. Ravi Patel was talking about this gosh about two weeks ago so I just did his deal two weeks ago and then I did it again yesterday. So I grabbed five of these. I had this home mailer which is a four off of 15. There was a bunch of um, scannable uh, Rite Aid coupons like a five off 15 and a five off 25. I think those have since they just took them out of circulation like they're not scanning anymore so I was happy to use this home mailer Ibotta has a two dollar rebate for each shampoo so you can do it up to five times so that's ten dollars back so um, again this is Rite Aid clearance five of those Pantene shampoos at three dollars and twelve cents a pop is fifteen sixty subtracting that mailer eleven sixty I rolled a bunch of bonus cash and then I got ten dollars back from Ibotta making it a dollar sixty for the five or thirty two cents per shampoo and again special thank you to Ravi for this offer one thing I do want to talk about is some clearance over at Rite Aid. A lot of baby stuff, the wipes and um, like a lot of lotions and soaps on 50% off. So when this is going to hit 75, 90, I don't know. But possibly in the next couple of weeks with deals, maybe some of this stuff might be advantageous to grab. But definitely look at the tags. Don't be shy to ask for price checks at the front. I would love to make big, big money on all this clearance. We'll have to wait and see how that works. We have 75% off on the Christmas uh, cookies, chocolates, those good items. Maybe you can repurpose it into something for Valentine's Day. And 90% off for the Christmas tags and gift wrap. And they had a large amount of that at the store. Okay, so the last store that we have is Big Lots and 75% uh, off started on Wednesday the 17th and I was there um, probably an hour after they opened. Um, I was looking for, see those mugs? We have a Christmas story and National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. So they were 10 bucks down to $2.49. Uh, those are gifts for next year. And then there's this Anchor Hawking. It's a three piece. It's called the Take and Bake. So it's a glass dish, the lid, and then something to carry it in. So you're like a Pizza Hut driver from the 80s. This was uh, $4.49, I believe. And I went on their website to see like non-Christmassy items that were still clearing out. And that's how I found it. I'm not some big lots genius. I'm excited for this stuff to hit 90. There was still a good amount left at the store. Um, and because of the snow, I couldn't go. There's like three big lots within, you know, an hour driving distance from me. However, not possible because the snow is just really, um, it's vicious the last week and a half. And I don't want to get in a car accident. So going to one store, coming home and just hoping for deals. So if the snow clears up, I'm definitely heading out to Family Dollar. That's it. I would go do that Family Dollar deal. It is so hot. And uh, if Big Lots is your thing and Christmas clearance may be worth checking out. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.